from your local election headquarters, it is a race that might not get a lot of attention, but tonight we're taking a closer look at a primary battle brewing in the local race for Democratic State Committee member. Our 18 News reporter Sharif DeKing joining us now live with more from your local election headquarters. Good evening, Sharif. Thanks, Zach and Rhea. There's a required number of signatures for each office that candidates must abide by in order to be considered for a particular race. In this case, two Democrats are laying out their platforms to earn signatures from residents to qualify for the New York State primary elections for a spot on the New York State Democratic Committee here in Chemon County. Two local candidates will face off in the Democratic primary this June for a seat to represent Chemon County on the New York State Democratic Committee. Willie Owens is challenging Nick Ahern. Oftentimes in these races, you don't have anybody running. And then the uh, chair of the uh, Democratic Party in Chemung County would have to appoint people. But in this case, um, we have a situation where Deborah Lynch is, is running. She's unopposed. Um, and we have a, a real uh, race between two folks for the seat that has to go to a man. Dr. Coleman says one of the issues raised is the lack of diversity on this committee. A lot of people um, like these two candidates and will sign papers, will show up to the polls, and uh, how many show up to the polls for each one will depend, I think, on who wins. This race will heavily depend on what candidate support system shows up to the polls. Willie Owens is African American. He's been in Elmira his whole life. Uh, Nick DeHearn uh, is Caucasian. Um, and so people might consider the diversity issue here. You know, do we want to have an African American gentleman representing us, representing Shimon County um, on the New York State Assembly Board? Navone says community members have up to June 3rd to get registered to vote for the June primary. However, if you would like to change your party affiliation, that time period has passed. There's the void period from February 14th, which is the last day to do it. So it's actually February 15th through July 5th, after July. So if you did it on March 1st, you changed your party affiliation, it would take effect on July 5th. Again, the New York primary is June 28th. The general election is November 8th. Your vote is your voice and your way to speak on change in your community. Live in the studio, Sheree D. King, 18 News.